So it is the day after Fort Love of Cubing 2017, and um, I was uploading things to my main channel uh, from the competition, and I feel better about Scube and Pyraminx. Um, I'll just do better next time, because there's it's just like to many people things like this have happened. I'm more upset about Pyraminx, but I mean, I have another chance. Um, but I have Pyraminx and Skube again at that Unionville comp, so that's next month. So I can, I have another chance then, and then whatever Florida comps come after that, and then there's also Nationals, so yeah. Um, but I don't expect to do as good as I normally would at Nationals, uh, it depends. Probably, I'll do better after my first things, but I'll probably, like, the first things will be, like, 6, 7, and Mega and stuff, so. Hopefully I will do good in that, those. I mean, I qualify for Mega Minx now. Hopefully, I qualify for six and seven at Unionville. So yeah. I got this is about to be seven thirty. I messed up on the G perm. I think that's a little slower than people. I was doing some five by five. I didn't get some good solves. I got four of them above one fifty, but I did get that BB, so that's pretty good. So yeah, I have a competition in two weeks. It does have five by five. It's um all aboard two thousand seventeen. So yeah. So I got my second ever sub eight, seven point ninety one, but still not full step. It was a uh, um anti soon, no AUF. So yeah, that's pretty exciting. So it's been exactly one year or three hundred sixty six days because this was leap year. This is my first competition because uh, last year for of Cuban was on the uh, thirteenth, which is on Saturday of last year. So yeah, one year since my first comp. <laughs> okay, I don't know what that was, but that's kind of like my first period class. He was just doing something weird. Anyway, I am still um, pretty happy about my results of four level cubing, except I'm so very upset about pyramids. That could have been even a sub five average if I got my cube and I didn't mess up so terribly. Um, so I had my cube and I wasn't so nervous because everyone was going crazy after the 2.94. Um, and I didn't, if I didn't sign up, sign off, I could have gotten an extra scramble and maybe I actually would have gotten a good solve because even that last scramble, it was a good scramble. So I could have gotten, because, um, the state record was set on that scramble, but I was getting nervous because I heard them, so I just did, like, whatever random color I saw that was okay. But I'm pretty sure I could have gotten a better layer and uh, just a better solve in general. Uh, even if I didn't, I could have at least gotten a six. But I had to set the cube down and it was off by two turns. And then I did one and then I did the tip. And then it was just upsetting. And then Scube, I just did terrible. Um, I got. I got like all the bad Sarah's intermediate cases that I uh, learned, but I was bad at recognition, so I didn't do them. Just did the base for getting the corners, and then I did two sledges, and then I got I got an H perm on one of the soles, which I rarely get H perms, and I got a few Z perms, and I messed up one time. I ended up doing four sledges just to get the center on top, so I ended up like messing up quite a bit and doing bad, locking up a lot. So yeah. And getting an 8-12 average, which is terrible. I rarely get even 7 averages, so it's not good at all. But um, I'm okay with that, because messing up two events isn't so terrible. 2x2, two two, just <laughs> sub-2 fail, single. About to get sub-2, locked up, messing up the anti-suit. And I, um... Um... Oh, and I could have one looked out, I was just too nervous, I was afraid I was going to mess it up. So yeah, but not as bad as what happened to Dalton Nichols. He was, he did, I saw him do the solve. He stopped the timer and it reset. So it was a DNF. It was about to be like a low two. He just like put his head down. It was like, I would be so mad if that happened to me. Um, I did get like an 11 in finals and it got DNF. I mean, 
I already got a 1086 average, so I wasn't as upset. And it's not like it was going to be an amazing solve. So, anyway. Um. So, yeah. And, uh, and then he, I saw on Cube Comps, he got a 1399 on 2 by 2 right after that. So, since the first one was a DNF, that was counting. So, got like a 7 average in finals. <laughs> It was like 13 and then like some normal solves like 3, 4, 5 or whatever. Um, we're like counting. So yeah. Still very excited for all aboard. Which is crazy how it's already not this weekend but next weekend. Need to practice FMC 4x4, 5x5 feet. And of course 3x3. And if they do end up having kill minks, let's hope to do better. I probably won't practice it. But I mean... I can do it better. I mean, I improved the Mega Minx. Just like Mega Minx, but the corners, so. Yeah. Hi! That was Sinjin. So, the last time he did that, he did something. I don't remember exactly what he did, but it was on Friday. And that delete video got deleted. I'm upset about that. I accidentally deleted the video from Friday. That was just this time. You go into fourth period and talking about probably the competition is going to be the next day. But I completely lost accidentally deleted it. I meant to delete the video from Wednesday, but I accidentally deleted the one from Friday. So that's upsetting. Anyway, it's all good. I'm working on editing the um, vlog from Saturday. I just finished editing the skewb um, average. I just saw how bad I did. So yeah. Look, um, this person on speed solving has a WCID that's one letter off from mine. And mine is 2016 Heart 2 his is 2016 Hera 2 That's pretty funny. I was in response to this. I wrote that on something that I forget. I didn't realize it was 2009. <laughs> I, I um, didn't know. I'm going to do a new thing. I want to know for all of in 10 days. Each day, I'm just gonna learn three. So here's the all, uh, here's the first all law of the day. This is a weird angle. Let's get a better angle. Yeah, no, this is fine, I guess. A, I can't do it with this angle. Yeah. So here's the all law of the day. See right here, this is the case right here. I get this all the time. I can easily recognize it. Next all law. I, I messed that up. Let me fix that. I got it now. Okay, it's because whenever I do the inverse scramble, I keep uh, inverse of the thing I messed up. I got it. The heck? The heck? I got it. I just did this a bunch of times. See? Got it. I was doing it so many times off camera, and every time I was on camera, I blinked. So the algorithms are that one, and then there's Couple. I'm gonna get confused with this J perm all the time. This is how it goes. It's the same as the J perm until the very end. Here's a J perm, and here's this. Let's get to the case. Just like um, a fat soon, except this corner is oriented correctly, and this one's to the left instead of to the back. So if I, I hold it like this. Got it. 
I remember my friend showed me this yesterday, but um, I mixed it up with the other case where it's right here. But this one is the one that's that. So I know four today. So these are all the algorithms I learned today. Nine new algorithms. See? I'm pretty sure that means I know 31 of those, but it might be incorrect. I think it might be more like... Oh, there's another one I know. I'm pretty sure it's 32. 